Hello everyone, I'm in Malaysia at the moment and I may have done a teensy bit of fabric shopping. I bought some gorgeous digital printed silk in Kota Kinabalu and decided to make a sarong. Not the sheet ones that we have in Europe, but the traditional tube style that's worn all over Southeast Asia. I figured it would be easy enough to make one without a machine, so from my travel stash I rustled up some needles and pins, some scissors, some thread in a nice navy colour, and I measured out two metres of fabric, although this method would work with just as well as one and a half. I folded my silk in half lengthways like this, with right sides together matching up the cut edges. I also left the selvages on to avoid unnecessary hemming. When pinning the cut edges together, I actually ran out of pins partway along and had to use spare sewing needles. Hashtag travel sewing problems. If I had a sewing machine, I would probably French seam this fabric, but instead I went for a slightly messy over edge stitch to stop everything fraying. This took a while. But a couple of days later, ta-da, I had one finished sarong. My favourite way to tie mine is to wrap one side over the front, where, well, getting it stuck on the wall is optional, and tie the sides in a knot at the hip. Smooth out the waistband and tidy everything up, and you're ready to roll. I'll probably have to reinforce my ropey stitching with some more ropey stitches at some point, but for now I'm just going to enjoy being extremely colourful. For more sewing adventures and general travel natter, you can find my blog at songofthestitch.com. Ciao!